disclaimer the site is chat.openai.com so you're going to enter the site and you're going to sign up with your email and your details so this our site will come up excuse that little bar at the top it's my recording i did not know how to remove it i'm going to put it into this corner so anyway so this is how the site would look like chat gtp where you're going to type your prompt here and to actually um, answer any of your questions so describe a mafia word where they are men women assassins drum men killers mobbers procedure capo and underpasses and this is it ladies and gentlemen this is chat gtp ai creating this so you might want to have to read through because there's some information we give you that well if you have the right time you may not be able to use but it will definitely give you detailed and broad information now i'm going to go further into uh, this dark romance book we are writing so this is the prompt provide a story arc for a mafia dark romance where a small territory with a weak mafia organization is attacked and a young girl is taken into captivity and so to a powerful couple has an arranged marriage with the couple and swears to take revenge on him and those people responsible for attacking her territory though at first she hates him and even tries to arm the couple generally they fall in love and he helps her to seek revenge come there and we're going to click on that who gives us a character name apparently the young woman name is sophia according to this ai that's a really good history so if we write sophia on this a particular chart the air we know what we are talking about Sophia and Marco remember when I said that this AI gives broad information now look it says that Sophia and Marco are on opposite sides of a bloody conflict and uh, love may not be sh may may not be enough to overcome the darkness that surrounds them it's good but what comfort like on that prompt we have list the chapters for the dark mafia romance novel about sophia and marco the first chapter is captive this is where sophia is taken to captivity and so to marco organization she's filled with rage and it tread towards him but tries to escape for revenge so it's giving us about how many chapters about seven chapters so with these chapters has given us we can ask more questions and get more answers just or to you ask for specifics so let's go forward and ask for a list of main and supporting characters their parents which include their facial features and their body beauty their personality We can go further to ask it to add more characters. Let's see what happens. So prompt add more characters and enter. Wow. That's added more characters. We have more of uh, Marco's family. Apparently one of Marco one of Sophia's cousins and assassin. Let's go for Oh, see right there. In the story, I was actually thinking of, I don't think there's need for police to So, if we want to use it, we can actually refer this character and it will give, give us some kind of instant kind of information where we we'll need to use it. Now, we're going to go further and talk about each chapter. And we have plotted. We have a brief summary of what the book's about. Now, can you provide a detailed outline of chapter one? What happens on each chapter? A detailed outline of each chapter that we're going to talk about now. So in the prompt, so I'm going to write how Sophia and her family was attacked by the Mafia and taken into captivity. And Valois. On that example of where it gives us a broad idea but doesn't tell us much details because again, it's an AI does not really have the creative capability to think about stuff like that anyway we're going to move to chapter two 
and our prompt is can you write pro can you provide a detailed outline of chapter two the arranged marriage house and resentment with that while sophia struggles with her hatred and resentment towards him and i'm giving us the detailed outline of chapter two of our hypothetical mafia dark romance novel okay let me give you an example of expanding on a particular idea so right now we already know that uh, when sophia and marco meet that they don't like each other but so i want this ai to describe the same for me with dialogue let's see if you can do it but i know you can do it but let me show you how you can do it so oh error okay this is very common using this ai when you get error like this you have to maybe tweak your language maybe it does not understand what you're trying to say it's your network in this case it's my network that's going on right now somewhere now can you see what makes my error i for the longest time i did not know that that slash over there was causing the error probably all maybe all this um one would have worked anyway new prompt sophia and marco meet each other for the first time and are preparing for their wedding provide a very long narrative that includes oral banter between Sophia and Marco showing their mutual hatred for each other and it gives us this in fact you can write dialogue it's actually very cool I actually like that but one thing I have come to notice is that if you give it it's the same scene maybe with, with different character names it will still produce the same dialogue so be careful when you use it <laughs> trick so if you don't like what she gives you you can click on that regenerate responses and it will use your previous prompt but change the response because i don't understand why it stops there but feel it tweak of tweak of what so we're gonna regenerate response and it is giving us no one I'm going back now because I want I'm looking for a look for the next chapter. Okay, the chapter three is titled um, Forbidden Love. So I'm going to copy that information because I wanted to know exactly what I'm going to talk about. This is me fixing the prompts. They are going to do it. If you want to use. This I'm going to do. If you want to use AI to write a book, you have to go to and impute each chapter as a prompt and ask it to explain. So, the prompt for chapter three is: Can you provide a detailed narrative of chapter three inside the chapter title? How Sophia and Marco feelings for each other grow grow stronger despite the dangers and taboo of their relationship. I don't know why their relationship is taboo the ai said it is but i have no idea oh look at this as sophia and marco relationship for each other grow stronger they knew they had to keep their love a secret from the rest of the mafia world why do why <laughs> i'm not supposed to be married let's use this character i'm going to look for a character let's use this is a member of um marco family the drugs man carlos marino marco. first of all let's let's know a little bit more about carlos let's see about carlos and sophia relationship the prompt is 
can you provide a detailed narrative with dialogue of Carlos and Sophia? Also, add small information in case they have forget. And right here we have Carlos' interaction with Sophia. Anyway, let's have some drama. So let's see what happens if Carlos is falling in love with Sophia. And we're still in the chapters, not in the plot, but let's see what happens. Ooh! To lead to some conflict, and these are possible scenarios that could arise. You look through, read, and see the one you can use. And this is nice. Marco could become jealous and possess of Sophia, leading to a rivalry with Carlos for her affection. This could escalate in a power struggle between the two men as they both try to win Sophia out and prove her worth to her. So, if you're doing this, just ask how you do it each scene, each chapter that needs explanation on it will definitely give you some update explanation so right now let's do chapter five i know i skipped four but um i'm intrigued to see what chapter five have as read listen to this as they gather more evidence sophia and marco realized the betrayal went than they thought they discovered that Nico had been working with Moriarty crime family, which is Marco's rival, and they have been planning to take down Marco and his organization for months. That's so nice, but who is Nico? I can't remember who is Nico. <gasps> Nico is the couple of a rival family. Okay, I guess that's how it became the rival family. So, Nico's crime family must have collaborated with Moretti to attack Sophia's family. I am thinking that's how it went down. There's a lot of drama going on. So, next prompt. Provide a narrative where Marco and his family fight and defeat Moretti. This is probably going to be around the last chapter. Let's see. Mm hmm Look at this. Marco was hailed as a hero. Oh, for a second, I thought he said died. Was hailed as a hero by his men, and Sophia was proud of him and his accomplishment. That's a bit um broad. Let's switch it up. Let's ask for chaos of moment. Can you see what I'm doing? New prompts. Provide a narrative where Marco and his family fight and defeat Moretti. Where Marco is shot trying to protect Sophia. Ooh. This. As the chapter ends, Sophia is left to tend to Marco's wound and hope for his recovery, knowing that their love and determination will see them through, even in their darkest, even in the darkest of times. So this is a narrative of Marco and his family fight and defeat. Anyway, so now you know how to write a book using ai um i will not advise you to do it like all through like from the beginning to the end but you could definitely play around with it and see if it can help you plot blurb maybe describe some scenes i guess people use ai now nowadays a lot um you can check the caption below i'm going to give you some 
blog post you can read where some author i think the author confirmed that she uses it sometimes i couldn't have done this without this without um, a blog post from medium i can't remember who the writer is but they really help so if if you feel this video can't you can't still get rid of video check out this the blog post down there um i provide the link below there uh yeah so you can really you can write up a book with this um i have really i've tried using it because um so that's it video thank you so much for watching be sure to like the video and um share it and comment